いくち Hi. Hello. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Hi. How are we doing today? Hello, hello, hello. Mwah. Welcome in. Welcome. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Oh my gosh. Well, well, well. Hey, yo. Ayo hey, Poco Pico Polly, thank you so much for the tier one for six months in advance. What the heck? Happy New Year! Thank you so much. Hi. Hello. Hi. 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 Hello. 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 How are you? How are you guys doing today? Are you having a good New Year? Oh, Niku, I'm sorry. I'm trying to open up Mix It Up right now. Can can a mod pretty please refund Niku for a second? And anyone else who... I don't know if anyone else tried to redeem something. It's opening right now, I promise. I had to have a little scuff. It was stream stream was too going too smooth, you know? It was going too smooth. I had to add some scuff in there. I had to add a little scuff to make it, you know, a strob stream, of course. Of course, make my merch thingy a little bigger. I gotta, I gotta promote the merch. The merch is too fly. Too fly for a white guy. Ayo. Ayo, I'm a, I'm a girl though. I swear. So many people are like, oh, VTuber, you must be a man. I'm not a man. I am a girl. I don't know how else to prove it to you besides just... Being honest and you believing me from the bottom of my heart. I'm just a good, good person. I'm not a liar. I'm a girl. Re. <laughs> Job isn't a man. How do I refund my sub? No, 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 no. Listen. Ayo, I can be anything you need me to be. I mean, what? Just keep your sub. Keep the sub. No, don't worry. Don't worry. I got you. <laughs> I'll be your little girly boy. <laughs> No, 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 no. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I am, I am a woman. <laughs> but you keep this up. Keep this up. <laughs> what is going on? Guys, listen. Today has been an interesting day. I've had an interesting day. Have you guys had an interesting day? <laughs> I started off my day... I woke up this morning and I said, you know what? New year. Save me. <laughs> I'm not doing anything different this year. Well, actually I am. I want to grind. This year I have so much like motivation in me for content right now. Like I just want to make content. I want to stream. I want to do cool YouTube videos. I want to make audios. I have so much motivation. So much motivation. But other than that, same me, of course. Of course. <laughs> but um, but yeah, so I woke up this morning and I was because it is now January 2nd, 2024. 2024. It is in fact a new year. Thank you for the blankie. <laughs> Thank you. It is in fact new year. Uh, which is crazy. I cannot believe it. It's 2024, guys. 2024, I have been making content since 2020. And we're starting it with Partner Plus. Let's go. All subs gifted and self-paid for the entire year. I'll get 70%. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm so happy. But dude, it's 2024. And I've been making... I've been, okay, I've, I've been streaming since 2021. I've been making YouTube videos since 2020, and I'm still here. That's like pretty cool, actually. I feel like so many YouTubers like graduate like with within four years. Four years? I feel like they're already gone. I'm so happy to still be here. I'm so happy to still be here. Yeah, it'll be 2025. That sounds even weirder. Like 2024 sounds weird, but 2025. 
That sounds like the legit future. Not that you are dual, well, guys. I already told you guys I'm never gonna graduate. I'm never gonna graduate because to graduate means like you're just gonna like this, like basically like you're gone. Like this, like you're gone from the internet with your like persona or whatever. But I'm never gonna really go away. You cannot get rid of me that easily. <laughs> so one day, well, I was actually talking to my friend about this last night. I had some people come over for New Year's, uh, which went really nice. Well. <laughs> There was a bit of a dilemma last night. I kind of. Aww. Hope it goes away. Well. Thank you. Congratulations again with Thank you so much. Happy 2024 Thank you so much. Also, I, I changed all the emotes around. You might have noticed. All the emotes are back to normal. We got a couple new ones here and there. Oh my gosh, yes, so I had... Oh, thank you for buying the straw and wrap throw blanket. Thank you so much. Thank you. But yeah, I had a, I had some people over last night, and one of my best friends came, and I had not seen her since my wedding. It was nice to see her for the holidays. And she helped me cook, and we hung out, and all this good stuff. And we were talking, like, late last night. And we were talking about, like... Because she works in schools, and, like, you know, I went to school. I went to college to be a teacher. For those of you who didn't know, now you know. And we were talking about just like education and like education systems and stuff. And I was like, I was like, do you think I'll ever teach? And she was like, no. <laughs> she was like, you don't want to. And I was like, okay, okay. Kind of true. And then I was like, just saying like, oh, I'm kind of sad because I always wanted to be a teacher. But all that to say, she was saying, um, I don't even remember exactly how we started talking about it. But she was saying like one day... I should, oh yeah, I was talking about this person that I know, and I was just saying like, oh, they, they're they so talented, they would just do so good, I feel like, to have someone manage them, because I feel like some people just need a little more guidance than other people, and I was just talking to my friend about it, and she was like, oh my gosh, you should do that, like, when you get a little older, and you maybe can't stream as much, like, when you have kids, like, you should try and manage people, and I was like, I've actually thought about this before, <laughs> I feel like I would actually be a really good manager. I feel like I would. I would be a good manager. But obviously I wouldn't want to do that while I'm a content creator myself because that's just too much. I already have to manage myself and I have to manage Rev. That's enough managing for now. <laughs> but one day in the future, maybe I would do that. That would be kind of cool, maybe. But, um, but yeah. <laughs> But last night went really well. It was, well, okay, it went good, but I had a teeny breakdown. Do you guys want to hear about my, my malfunction last night? <laughs> Do you want to hear about my malfunction? Okay, I'm going to tell the story to you, and I want you guys to tell me if you think I'm crazy, okay? Story time. Story time. My chat gets to tell me if I'm crazy and overreacting or if I'm a valid, okay? <laughs> so, I hosted a New Year's Day dinner last night for some friends, and I had one of my friends come over, and her mans came with her, and uh, uh, <laughs> it's so awkward, I don't even know how to like explain it. Um, this man walks in with his laptop, his laptop is like open and it's on a football game and he is glued to this football game and he brings his computer in and he sits it on our table in the living room and nothing was playing. I was expecting to play some music but they got there early so I no did not put the music on yet um, and he's just playing his uh, football game out loud of his laptop. And I'm just like, oh, okay. And I offer him, like, Do, would you want to put it on the TV? Because the TV wasn't on. And he's just like, um, uh, like, he doesn't really answer me. And I'm like, can, can you put it on the TV? Like, and I yell, like, no response. So I'm kind of annoyed, right? I'm like, okay, interesting, different. Um... <laughs> Oh yeah, he had our Wi-Fi from when he's been here before, so I'm assuming he was using our Wi-Fi. Um, but... <laughs> so, I go over to my Alexa, and I'm like, Alexa, play, 
um, holiday music because I wanted to play some music. Even though he's listening to his football game, but I'm like, whatever. This is my house. I invited everyone over here and I wanted music. Tell me why my Alexa doesn't answer me. Because this man unplugged it to plug in his laptop <laughs> with my charger. I thought he brought his charger the whole time. It was dead ass my charger he found from underneath the table. He unplugged my Alexa to plug in his laptop. And just this whole night, like my family gets here and he's just like huddled around his computer watching the game. And my family's here and uh, like awkward, like my family doesn't like, we're not really big like football people. And it was just awkward. The whole thing was awkward. I was stressed out. I tried to not like, you know, make a scene. I went to the other room and like got really upset. <laughs> and um, yeah, that was basically how the entire night went. They were there for about two hours and he just uh, watched the game the entire time. But then half of the time he was literally on his phone. So it's like the game is playing out loud and he's on his phone. He's like double screening it. Um, and so has, is that what our generation has like turned into? Like, yeah, like adult iPad kids. I was really upset. Am I, am I crazy to be upset about that? <laughs> Cause in my opinion, if the games that are important to you don't come, or if you really, really, really want to watch the game, maybe just check the score on your phone while you're there for like an hour and then go back and maybe just don't stay as long. He must have had a lot of money on that game. I do believe he does gamble. <laughs> now that you say it. But, I mean, I wasn't going to say anything. I can't say anything. Like, I'm not. I'm not going to start, you know. But in my head now, I'm like, I don't want to invite him over ever again. <laughs> for like that. Like, if it's just like chill, whatever. But like, for like an actual like dinner party that I was hosting. And like, I spent so long getting all the food prepared. And like... I was so upset and I know part of it is like I'm a little bit of a control freak and I like things like I had this like vision in my head of like oh it's gonna be like this blah blah like I put so much time and effort I was so excited about it and then it was just very much not the vibe that I was wanting it to be um but you know <laughs> it'd be like that sometimes I guess <laughs> gold muffin thank you so much for the 10 gifted subs what the heck Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Yeah, I agree, Risto. There's a difference between um, like visiting for a dinner and just hanging out. Cause like if it was just like a chill, like casual thing, I wouldn't have been like really bothered by it or at least as bothered. I mean, I feel like it's just weird to kind of do that without even asking to just start playing something in someone's home. I just feel like it's weird, <laughs> I don't know. And then I was like, am I overreacting? But, you know, yeah. <laughs> Hi, Naku. Welcome in. Hello. Are we still tracking gifted subs? Yes, please. Oh, well, actually, Risto, we're not tracking them for the community stream this weekend. We're tracking them for our sub goals. Um, so, actually, I guess I don't need to technically be tracked on the, on the spreadsheet. Um, but all the gifted subs today, today is the last day uh, to hit any sub goals we have. Our next goal is 395, a new song cover. But of course, if we don't hit it, it's not a big deal. Um, but yeah, today is technically the last day. I said it was until the 2nd of January, so today is the last day. Yes, yes. Ugh, he was about as disrespectful as human could be. And the thing is, I feel like it was a difference in how we're raised. So, I tried to just, you know, remind myself that and uh, calm myself down because I was very upset. <laughs> but I'm just not the type of person that will, like, confront someone. Like, I couldn't. I couldn't say anything. Um, but I was just, I was very disappointed. I was mostly just disappointed and, like, sad. And also just, like, confused because... Who thinks that's okay? Do you know what I mean? Like, who... Who... Does that? <laughs> it's just so weird. And your friend was okay with it? Yeah, she didn't. She was just very much, like... Doesn't care. About anything. I don't know. 
<clears throat> I don't know. It was just it was it was weird. But all that to say, once they left and my family left, I felt kind of bad because I was kind of in a bad mood around my family and I felt kind of bad about it. So I was trying to like, you know, I went to the, the bedroom and sat down for like a couple minutes like by myself and just kind of like was in the dark and the quiet and like, okay, everything's okay. Calm down. Smile. Go back outside and talk to your family and be happy. Um, and then once my family left, they left like right after. And then it was just me and my best friend and uh, Rev uh, for like the next, it was like from like eight o'clock until like, my friend didn't leave until almost midnight. So that part was really nice and really needed. And so I had a really good like end of the night, but yeah, the beginning was a little rough, but it's okay. We had really yummy food. I got barbecue and brisket. Mostly the brisket was for the guys. I'm not really a big brisket person, but um, I made coleslaw and collard greens and black eyed peas and corn casserole and deviled eggs and Oreo balls for dessert. And what else did we have? There was something else I'm forgetting. I swear there was something else. Anyways, yeah, it was a lot of good food and it was very yummy and a good time. And yeah, it was nice. So it's nice. I even got little, I little, I, <laughs> I even got like, um, like styrofoam containers for people to take leftovers with them. Cause I knew, oh yeah, mac and cheese, mac and cheese, we had mac and cheese. Cause I knew there would be a lot of food left over. And so I let people take leftovers home with them. And I even let the, the grown iPad baby man take food home with him. <laughs> Oreo ball, what is it? I want it. So basically all you do, I used my big KitchenAid um, mixer and I took two packages of Oreos and I like crushed them up in the KitchenAid and then I put that to the side and I put two blocks of cream cheese in the KitchenAid mixer and blended that until it was kind of like whipped and then you just combine everything together in the KitchenAid mixer and it makes this like really thick um consistency and then you freeze you turn them into balls and you freeze them and it's so good it's so good oh my gosh if you've never had oreo balls you need to eat them they're so yummy hi philip welcome and hello also guys if you tier 3 subbed at any point during october november or december please make sure you've checked your discord dms and slash or your twitch whispers if i knew you guys were in the discord if i knew your username i sent it through discord because i feel like discord just easier for messaging but some of you are not in the discord or i didn't know what your discord username was so i just went ahead and sent it to you over on twitch so yeah if you don't mind the music what just happened give me my music back oh yeah i had to loop it i had to loop her I got the coolest new background music. I found this uh, this uh, YouTuber that makes this free background music. Let me uh, show you guys their YouTube channel. Thank you for the follow. I credited I credited them in my uh, in my credits, but if you don't want to go to my credits, this is their YouTube. If you stream and you need any free background music. Um, you can use their background music. I just would credit them, of course, but yes, it's very nice, very good. They actually, I followed them on Twitter and they followed me back immediately. It was so nice. And I DM them and I was like, Hey, do you mind if I use this on my stream? And they were just like, yes, of course. Thank you so much for following my YouTube channel. I was like, you're welcome. Thank you. What are black eyed peas? I've never heard of that. So my family, I think it's kind of like a Southern thing. But my family always had collard greens and black eyed peas for uh, New Year's because it's supposed to be like good luck. It's supposed to be good luck. So hopefully I'll have good luck this year. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. The band, it's not the band. Oh yeah, we would have cabbage too, but we had our cabbage in our coleslaw. It wasn't the exact same as like, you know, like boiled cabbage or however you prepare your cabbage it was just like we just shredded the cabbage in the coleslaw so that was our cabbage and black eyed peas and collard greens and 
My family usually also does cornbread, but we did barbecue sandwiches, so I felt like that was enough, like, bread. Because we had, like, buns, so I felt like it was kind of weird to have cornbread and buns. So, and also I made so much food, I was like, <laughs> we, we don't need any more food. I literally, because I have cornbread next. I could have made some, and I almost did, I thought about it, and I was like, that is too much. <laughs> Aw, thank you, Cool Muffin. You guys are so sweet. Thank you, thank you, Isekai, for the for the French toast on head. Oh well, look at how it jiggle. So the next thing on my list of weird things to happen to me today. So uh, this morning I get ready and I wake up this morning. Obviously, I woke up first. That's the first thing you do because that's the first thing you do when you wake up is you wake up. And so then I was like, okay, my goal for today is to. Um, order the rest of all the merch for tier threes and send out all the uh, tier three like Google Forms. So I did all that. And then when I was doing that, I was, you know, messaging people on Twitch. And so I had already messaged the person who had, because yesterday on the first, that was all, that was the only work I did yesterday was sending people their, um, their gift cards from the community day stream. Anyone who won a gift card or a gift card code, I sent it to them. And the person who won the DoorDash one, I, uh, I, <laughs> I had actually saw that they had messaged me. So keep in mind, um, my stream, my community day stream was from 4, 4 p.m. Eastern time for about five hours the night before New Year's Eve, okay? And then New Year's Eve came, and I wanted to relax and enjoy the holiday, right? So, New Year's Day, I'm also relaxing, but I was like, I'm gonna send gifts out to people. And I see they already messaged me, and they messaged me New Year's Eve night, and said, Hey, reminding you to send me my gift card. And immediately I was kind of just like, oh, okay, like... Calm down, you're gonna get your gift card. It's, it was New Year's Eve night. Um, okay, I, I will, I'll get that to you. And so it, I had the gift card in the form of a PDF. So I wanted an email from them so I could send them the PDF in email. Um, so I messaged back that the account and I'm like, hey, if you can just give me a good email, I would appreciate it, thanks. Um, so yeah, and then that's all I did. Uh, I sent everyone their stuff. I waited for them to send me their email. And that was that. Um, <laughs> so then yeah, today I was sending out all the tier 3 sub stuff. And I see um, they didn't message me back on that account. But I did get a DM from a different account um, on Discord and Twitch saying hey so sorry it was hard to get in touch with me i i was the winner of the gift card and so i'm thinking this person's like trying to scam me or something and i was like oh this is weird why why is this person and like the person's name was like something it was like distorted not distorted it was like something something slur not like an actual slur, but the word slur. And I was like, I don't know, that already kind of rubbed me the wrong way. I'm like, who who has a username like that? Like, what? And so I was already like, hmm, interesting. And then I was like, well, so I thought this person... Hold on, I'm going to sneeze. Ha, huh, I'm muted. Anyway. I thought this person was trying to scam me, right? So I'm like, hmm. So I go on to Discord, or not Discord, I go on to Twitch, and I become a detective, and I do the backslash, um, <laughs> thank you so much for the tier one, uh, interwegs for seven months, thank you, mwah, mwah. Uh, I go onto dis or, uh, go <laughs> I go into Twitch and I'm like I'm gonna be a detective and I do the backslash user and I do their username and I'm like have they chatted in chat before? What were the chats? How long have they followed me? And I'm looking, and the person that won the gift card they had only followed that day, and they only had a few messages in the Discord, um, and it was all just the ones from the giveaway. And their last message was something about me annoy me ignoring them. And I think we just ignored that message because we were just like, oh, what? 
Um, and then I do the backslash user on the other account that messaged me and said that they, the one I thought was scamming me. And then I see that their only message in my uh, channel was, Darling Straub, it is clear you don't care about your viewers. And they were immediately, they weren't actually banned, they were timed out by Risto. Risto was being nice. <laughs> I banned them later. Um, and I was like, so this guy is trying to scam me because he got banned and like, you know, whatever. And so then I go back because I also had that same account tag me on Twitter a couple times and being like, scammer, blah, blah, blah. Well, if that account wouldn't have tagged me on Twitter, I never would have noticed when I went to the Twitch account of the guy who I had the username written down that won, that messaged me on New Year's Eve. His entire Twitch account was blank, but he had a Twitter linked to that Twitch account, and that Twitter was the same Twitter that tagged me on Twitter. So I realized it was all the same person. They're just a psychopath, I guess. I don't know, something is... Something is going on. I don't know what's going on with them, but if you look at all their all their replies, it's like they do the same thing to other streamers. Um, a lot of like real life like cam streamers, not a lot of YouTubers, but I don't know why they chose me as the YouTuber, I guess, to mess with. But all that to say, I guess they technically did win it on their alt account. Um, but they were already banned on the one account for saying, you know, rude stuff to me. And I guess they rejoined on a different account and joined the giveaway and won. But I'm like, I'm not giving you this gift card. So I blocked them everywhere. <laughs> I blocked them everywhere. And then I get a really sweet, um, you might saw it on my Twitter. I get a really sweet email from them basically saying... You are a nobody, you stupid scammer. Like, you should go and in game yourself. And I'm like, all this over a $40 DoorDash gift card. Bro really wanted his DoorDash. Bro really wanted his Taco Bell real bad. He was real hungry. <laughs> he was hangry. <laughs> Bro was hangry. Um, but I just blocked his email too. And, well, that was the end of that, so. That was my other story of some other like crazy. I don't even know. I don't know where these people are coming from But um, yeah, <laughs> he was hungry for that five guys Yari, he wishes he would have gotten that five guys gift card <laughs> Can I have the DoorDash gift card and said well, we're actually about to do a giveaway for it because I said um No, I don't care if you want it. He's not getting it I'm gonna re re-roll it for my community Cause I'm not giving a gift card to that asshole. Like what? Especially when he told me to go gaming myself. I'm like, okay, yeah, that really sealed the deal. Maybe if he would have sent me a super like heartfelt apology or something, I still probably wouldn't have given it to him. But like, I wouldn't have thought of him as like such a disgusting, awful person. But I'm like now, now, unforgivable, unforgivable, sir. <laughs> unforgivable, sir. But, uh, yeah. So we're about to do the giveaway right now. Right now. Neko! Neko, oh my gosh. Thank you so much for the resub at tier 3. Thank you so, 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 so much for 16 months. Gold Muffin, what are you doing? Gold Muffin, what? What? Huh? Huh? What? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you so much, Gold Muffin, for the 50 tier 1 subs. I guess we're getting the cover. Oh my god. Well, I was not expecting to do a cover. Oh dear, and now I gotta pick my song. I had a couple ideas for the song, but oh my gosh. You guys. Go Muffin, thank you for the level 9 hype train! The level 9, what the heck? Oh my gosh. <sighs> what on earth? What is going on? 
What is going on? Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Wait, did this help go update on its own? Oh wait, no, now it did, now it did, now it did. I was like, it took a second. Jerry, thank you so much for gifting a sub to the channel as well. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh my lord. We did it, chat. We freaking did it. I'm kind of shook right now. I'm like in a in a trance. I'm in a trance right now. <laughs> oh, for the hype train! Choo choo! Choo choo! I'm so drunk. No! Oh my gosh! Do not drink and get subs. How many times do I have to tell you that? Don't drunk dial the subs. Oh my gosh, you guys. What is going on? Thank you, Naku, for the sub sub. I really appreciate it. I need it. I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. So we hit the new song cover. Our next goal is a Yandere ASMR stream. So at 495. 495. Which we only have until the end of today. So I know it's probably not going to happen. But if for some reason it happens, uh, if for some reason we get 95 more subs by the end of stream, we'll be doing a Yandere ASMR stream. Ayo. Ayo. Oh god. It's so slow. The way it types, it's so slow. Oh my gosh. It's okay. I promise I can work for all. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Please never feel pressure to do anything like that, but I appreciate it so much. Thank you. Narwhal, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Thank you so much. Mwah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, Isekai, no. I don't want you doing anything. I don't want anyone doing anything. <laughs> gifted subs aren't on sale anymore. Although it's so rude that Twitch decided to make the gifted stuff the gifted subs um until the second, but it was until the second at 1 p.m. Eastern time. Or was it 12? It was like early. I was like, uh, excuse me, why'd you do that to us? <laughs> I don't stream that early. <laughs> I don't stream that early, so, but that's okay. <laughs> it's not a big deal. We'll have more opportunities for that in the future, aka September. <laughs> no, 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 Narwhal. <laughs> You're not Narwhal, I'm you more gamer, sorry. Gotta sleep now. Oh, good night. Rest well, rest well. Oh, but yeah, that was so funny today. Uh, but yeah, so now we're gonna do a giveaway for the DoorDash gift card. Let me pull up Nightbot so we can do the giveaway. As I said the other day, please only join the give. Oh, I guess I should know. Should I have not said that the other day, guys? I said the other day when we were doing the giveaways, I said, please only join the giveaway if you really want the gift card. Because if you don't want the gift card, you know, why join the giveaway? Because I'm going to send it to you and you're not going to use it. Or you're going to be like, I don't want this. And I guess when I said that, the man's took it to heart. He wanted that DoorDash gift card. Okay? He wanted it. <laughs> he wanted it real bad. <laughs> so maybe I shouldn't have said only join if you really want it. Because he took that to heart. He said, bro, I need Yeah, he, he didn't want it. He needed it. <laughs> he needed it. Bro, you're my favorite ASMR streamer. Oh, I'm doing two ASMR streams this week, by the way. Two ASMR streams this week, so you can look forward to this. I know I didn't do a lot of ASMR last week. I only did a little bit um, during the community day at the end. But yes, I will be doing two this week, so you can look forward to those. Because I know people missed it last week, but unfortunately, you can only do so many things in a week. But, yes. Two? For the price of two? That's a steal! <laughs> it truly is. It truly is a steal. Okay, so we're about to do the giveaway. <laughs> Daikon, thank you so much for gifting a sub to the viewers. Thank you. Mwah. 
Thank you so much. I will say if you won a gift, if you won a giveaway already, I would prefer if you didn't join just so we give everyone an opportunity to win something. But that being said, let's see. Well, actually, no, I only wanted to do that for the advanced TG gift cards. Uh, so you know what? Everyone can join this giveaway because it's different. It would be one thing if you won like one of the advanced TG giveaways and I didn't want you to join like multiple advanced TG giveaways. But for the giveaway today, everyone can join. Okay. I think that makes more sense. So let me think of my keyword. Think of my keyword. <laughs> it has to be a good one, okay, guys? I feel so much pressure right now. I feel so much pressure right now. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? <laughs> Do, 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 do. Oh yeah, that's true, Ace. If you also live in the middle of nowhere and you can't get DoorDash, sadly, I would say also don't don't join the giveaway because like you're not gonna be able to get it. Okay, the keyword is nom nom. N o m n o m together, all is one word. Nom nom. Om nom 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 nom. nom. Um, nom 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 Please type nom nom in the chat for a chance to win the $40 DoorDash gift card. Yes, not case sensitive. Only if you want it. Have DoorDash available and please don't be a psychopath. Those are the terms and conditions for this giveaway. <laughs> Only if you want it. Have DoorDash available and please don't be a psycho. Thank you very much. Nom nom. <laughs> nom nom. Mm -hmm. Yummy. And don't get me wrong. I get it. DoorDash is fire, okay? However. And you know, you want to know the craziest part? You want to know the craziest part about all this that's so funny to me? And it really is a testament to, like, people not being, um, well, A, self aware. <laughs> And be patient, because patience is a virtue. Um, but if they would have just waited and been patient for literally one day, I would have just sent them, I would have just sent them the gift card. And they would have gotten it. I wouldn't have even known that they were the same person that got banned. And none of this would have even, they would have gotten their gift card. Now, do I think they deserved it? No. I don't, but like they would have gotten it. I would never have known. <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's kind of interesting. But yeah, who knows what happened? Basically, the person that won the DoorDash gift card the other day was like an alt account of someone who got banned for saying something mean in chat to me. Um, and it was just this whole weird situation. I don't know. It was so weird. And uh, they were just really upset that they didn't get their DoorDash gift card. <laughs> and they started uh, spamming at me from their their uh, email. I got a few emails. I showed you guys the most aggressive email. I got a couple more. And then... <laughs> but that was definitely the, the, the winner out of the emails. And then I got a few um, pings on, on Twitter. I will say they deleted their first... Um, Twitter ping where they like tagged me in a tweet. They like deleted it. It was like a couple hours before they sent the other ones. What do I order if I win? I don't know. What do you have around you? What's your favorite thing to DoorDash? <clears throat> I love a good. Well, when I was in college, my favorite thing to DoorDash was Taco Bell or Chick fil A. Well, I didn't really DoorDash Chick fil A. I used their app because they had like their own delivery drivers. But I used to DoorDash talk about all the time with my friends, especially when I was in college and I would get really drunk. And when they had the grilled cheese burritos, which the grilled cheese burritos are back, but honestly, I can't have a grilled cheese burrito when I'm sober. 
I don't think they taste very good. Or I'm not gonna say they taste bad. They are not bad, but they taste way better when you're really, really, really intoxicated. I just, I don't know. I feel like when you're sober, it's just too much, you know? Like it's too much when you're sober. But when you are very, very, very intoxicated, oh my God, it hits. It hits very well. <laughs> <laughs> will you check DMs after a stream? I will I will check them. I can't guarantee it'll be after stream and I could sleep, but I will check DMs tomorrow, don't worry. Please um please avoid asking me to check DMs during the stream though. It gets kind of it gets kind of um what's the word? Distracting. Cause my brain my brain goes like if someone tells me like I DM'd you, my brain is like, I have to look. And I have already learned the hard way multiple times to not check DMs during a stream. Because in multiple ways, it has ruined streams for me. <laughs> I remember one time I had a viewer message me. This was like over a year ago. They they chatted in my chat and they were a regular, you know. Well, I wasn't expecting anything weird. And they were like, hey, Straub, can you please check your DMs? And so I'm like, yeah, sure. So I go to check my DMs and they wrote me a long, long, long DM about how they were so upset with me because I don't give them attention that they deserve and that they have been a viewer of mine for, I think it was like eight months and they sub every month at tier one and they are so supportive of me and they just don't understand why I'm purposefully ignoring them and skipping over their messages in chat and that it breaks their heart. I mean, it was a long message. And I was just like, whew, okay. Um, <laughs> it was a lot to be hit with in the middle of a stream. Um, and I was just like, oh, right, uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, oh no. <laughs> Can confirm, if someone buzzy talk about when I'm not sober, I'm gonna love them forever, for sure. For sure, for sure. Do do. I'm affected by the ASAP thing. Like I said, I will, I will message you, don't worry. Nothing needs to be done. When I say ASAP, because when I sent people there, um, the tier three stuff, I said, you know, please fill this out ASAP. I don't mean like ASAP, no, no, no. I just mean like as soon as possible, like at your convenience, like things are going to take a f probably like anywhere from one to two months to ship to me anyways things are probably not going to even be getting here i th the the prints will get here in the next couple weeks the stickers will get here probably in the next week the standees um from what i heard from hills they take a while i don't even think she's gotten her standees yet and she ordered them over a month ago so i will be letting you guys know when i have an update on when the standees will come in but i might not be able to ship stuff until maybe even march and i'm really sorry um but i can't help it like until i get the merch in my possession <laughs> i cannot send it to you but i promise as soon as i get everything i will send it to you um that being said i'll go ahead and have everything packaged as well as i can so that I have, you know, the packaging together, I have the sticker, the print, and the moment the standees come in, I can just shove them in the bags and send them to you guys, okay? But, um, I don't know, they might, they might come the end of January, they might come in February, they might come in March. I really don't know, it comes from China. The, uh, website, I've ordered my keychains from this website multiple times, um, and it all comes from China, it's very good quality. But it does take a little while, you know, especially with the holidays and stuff. Shipping is, you know, you never know. <laughs> but I promise I am doing my best. Wasn't that shortly after you got engaged, too? I don't remember, to be quite honest. Probably, Captain. Probably. Guys, remember, if you would like to enter to win the DoorDash gift card, $40 DoorDash gift card, please type the word nom nom in chat. Nom nom. <laughs> I do it ASAP while bowing down and praising Straub. Crap, did I say that out loud? <laughs> hey, I appreciate it. I appreciate it, okay? Get Straub's package in May. Ooh, 
feed a present from Strom. Oh, in all seriousness, it's good. It will get here when it gets here. I will say my community is gener generally pretty nice and kind and understanding when it comes to those things. I feel like all people ever usually want is like a heads up and an update. I mean, obviously, we'd all like to have it right now, you know? Like, <laughs> we'd all like to just be able to have it right this very second, but, you know, it is it is like that sometimes. Praise the Baka Nucko! Hey, who are you calling a Baka? Who are you calling a Baka? That's not very nice. Yeah, that's not nice. That's not nice. I'm a good person. I'm a good person. I don't deserve this. <laughs> I'm a good person. I don't deserve this. I'm offended. Until we get teleportation, instant delivery will never exist. Bro, I wish. I wish that I existed. I have you and Rev on my GG cup, and it's my most fave cup. Aw, Loki of Asgard. Ayo, I love Loki. God, I want to rewatch Loki now. It's been a little, it's been like a, like a couple months-ish. Yeah, two, two-ish months maybe. Since I finished uh, Loki season two. And I'm like, oh, I need to rewatch it. I love Loki too, but it's a different Loki. A different Loki? What Loki do you like? What? What Loki do you like? Oh. He's an alien. Alien? What is the- Oh! Loki, SG Command. He was a rogue Asgard scientist. Oh my gosh, I've never heard of this. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, interesting. This is different. Actual Loki from North Mythology. It's Loki, not Loki. It's from Stargate, the Asgard. I don't know anything about this, but that's crazy that that's a thing. I'll have to do some more research. He's a little... He's a little alien guy, though. He's cute. He's, like, cute and yet ugly at the same time. He's... You know when something is so ugly that it's cute? Like me? Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Ugly cute, I know what you mean. Yeah, it's like the naked, like, hairless... Dogs that look like rats. <laughs> you know what I mean? There's a YouTuber I watch that has movie and TV watch reaction vids. Him and his girlfriend are just starting Loki season two. It's making me want to rewatch it too. Nah, those are just ugly, ugly. No, they're ugly cute. There is no such thing as a pet that's ugly. They're all adorable. Like some babies. <laughs> no, stop the cap. Okay, this is my last time I'm saying it. If you would like to enter to win the $40 advanced, or not advanced, <laughs> the $40 DoorDash gift card. Bro, advanced GG on my mind for real. They are my mind for real. <laughs> if you'd like to enter to win, please type nom nom in the chat. Please type nom nom in the chat. Okay? Nom nom. This is your final chance. This is your final chance. Yes, Advanced GG and DoorDash, they're, they're very, they are very different. But if you want some advanced CG, you can totally use code STRAW for 10% off your purchase. <laughs> Exclamation point ADV in the chat. <laughs> oh, I think I tried to update my, uh, my emotes for the command, but I think it must not be love. It must be heart. 
I couldn't remember. I was like rushing before stream to try to update some commands. Because I noticed, um, I think it was, I don't know if it was 13 or Narwhal. Someone like typed a command in the chat and it spammed like the wrong thing. And I was like, oh shit, I didn't update any commands. <laughs> so I was like running through trying so hard. Can you at least tell me things are going to be okay? The rewards are off. Go Muffin. <laughs> of course things are going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay for everyone, okay? Nothing can possibly go wrong. Because, you know, you want to know something I heard the other day? I actually said it in one of my, uh, one of my YouTube videos. Because it was in a script. But I've actually said this myself before. And I've heard it before. You have survived 100% of your bad days. There has never been a bad day that you've had. Think about your worst days. You never didn't survive them. You're still here. You're still here. You'll you'll be fine. And you'll be and you'll feel full better, you know? You've always survived every bad day you've ever had. And you'll keep doing it, you know? And you know, sometimes life is hard, but then sometimes life is really good. You know, trust me, a couple weeks ago, and I won't get into it, but a couple weeks ago. I was a- I was not happy. Well, more like a month ago. Actually, not exactly a month ago. Exactly a month ago, I was getting married. A little over a month ago. <laughs> I was not very happy. I was- I was very, very stressed out. And I felt like I was at rock bottom, honestly. I felt like I couldn't get any worse. Um... And now here I am, and I'm just fine, and I feel great. So, it's just kind of crazy, because sometimes there are times in your life where you're genuinely like, Holy shit. This is the end. It's never going to get better. And I've experienced those. I know. But it does get better. Like, it, it will. Like, and you're not going to feel that way forever. And then you're going to realize, wow, I thought it was going to be like that forever and it's not anymore. That's nice. And then you know that you can get through it. And it makes the next time you're sad a little easier, maybe. You know? So, hopefully that helps. And I know it's easier said than done. Life is hard, but you got this. I promise. Okay? That is a strawby guarantee. You're gonna be okay. <laughs> and if you're not okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. Was expecting <laughs> was expecting Zatsu. Got head talk. Well, you know me. I love to talk. Talk, talk, talk. <laughs> Okay, we're about to roll. Get excited. Get excited. Ayo. La 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 Gold Muffin! <laughs> no way! Oh my gosh. Someone's looking out for you. That's crazy. Out of everyone. It was like... A lot of people. There was a lot of people in that giveaway. It was like 20 something people. Congratulations. 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 You win! Rigged. <laughs> Rigged. No. That's crazy. You won the $40 DoorDash gift card. Congratulations. Yeah, you won the lore pilled gift card. You get a story with your gift card. <laughs> it's not just a regular gift card. It's a gift card with a story. With lore attached to it. It's a special wow. thing. Congratulations! You can get Tornash drinks! Oh my gosh, no! No, he needs to get some yummy food and sober up a little. And and have a good, good sleepy time. Yeah. Oh, I gotta, we gotta edit that one too, Risto. <laughs> Not the Strawby love Christmas. Strawby do love Christmas, though. <laughs> I am Strawby and I approve this message. I approve this message. La 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 la. 
。わわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわわ Rev mentioned Chipotle, but I don't know if I want Chipotle. I don't know what I want. I don't know what I want. I feel kind of picky right now. I'm not usually very picky, but. Taco Bell? I do actually have Taco Bell gift cards. I have like multiple Taco Bell gift cards. <laughs> Because I think I was talking to chat about this, but, um. I literally got the Taco Bell gift cards、uh, from Christmas 2021 from Rev's family. And we just found them the other day. <laughs> Because back, okay, that was my first Christmas with his family in person. And I was just kind of shy, you know. His family was like, it was his family, his family's house. And I was just shy. And whenever they gave us the gift cards and everything for Christmas,、um, and all the cards and everything, I just let him hold on to it and him do whatever he wanted to with it. Because I was like, oh, I'm just the girlfriend. Like, I'm, you know, it's his family. I was trying to be like polite, you know?、Um, <laughs> and so literally. Literally, um, and he just left it sitting. He just left it sitting in a bag, in a plastic bag, inside of our like coffee table because our coffee table like rises up. It literally just like sat down there. <laughs> also, Gold Muffin, I just sent you the PDF for the gift card on, on Discord, so You can use it tonight if you want. It doesn't expire. It says it doesn't expire, I believe. So, you got time. You got all the time in the world. <laughs> But if you want it now, you got it. 40 bucks. There you go. Bada bing, bada boom. Domino's Pizza just opened its first restaurants in my country. And when I was in、um, college, I was like, I loved a good Domino's Pizza. And I remember, thank you for the follow. I remember, um, Being in high school and like, oh my god, Domino's was like fancy, okay? It's 1 a.m. here. Oh, I forget that you don't live, you don't live like in the US. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, you can get it another time if you want. Or if you have like overnight, I don't know what, you, what you're up to. I don't know. But, anyways, when I was in high school, Domino's was like the fancy pizza, okay? My family got, um, oh, what's it called? Little Caesars. <laughs> My family was a Little Caesar family, the $5 pizza. And which is fine. It wasn't what I liked. And my mom always had to get pepperoni because my brothers like pepperoni, even though I only like cheese. I don't like pepperoni pizza. I mean, now I will eat pepperoni pizza, but it's never something I would go for. I remember my own birthday parties having to get pepperoni pizza because. Well, the boys like pepperoni pizza. You can just pick them off your pizza. It doesn't matter if you pick them off. It was baked with the pepperonis on it, and the pepperoni juices are on it, and it tastes like pepperoni, whether it's pepperoni or not. Oh, But, anyways, I always wanted Domino's, and I would literally have to ask my mom. I'd be like, because I did have a job. I was making $7.25 an hour.、Uh, I was rich. I felt like I was rich. When I got that job, I was like, I'm so rich. Bringing home like $200 and something dollars every two weeks. <laughs> and I'd literally be like, Mom, I'll pay for the pizza if we can get Domino's. And I would do the online order because if you did online order, you could get two, two topping pizzas for like, it was like $6 or $7.99 each. And I was like, it's literally a couple dollars more than the Little Caesars. You just gotta do it online. My mom would never do it online because she's a boomer. So, basically, the more you know. And now I rarely ever eat pizza, to be honest. It's just not something I ever like, think about having. Although, there is this really good local place、um, around my college that has like, the best pizza. It's so good. And yeah, so if we ever, if we ever go there, I really like the pizza, but. 
For the most part, I don't really get pizza very much. Ooh, but Pizza Hut has really good wings. So, like, I'll get some pizza from Pizza Hut. But, like, I want their wings. Although their wings are so expensive. Why are wings so expensive? What the hell? And, like, bone-in. You know, I used to, like, not be a bone-in girly. I was like, no, boneless only. Bone-in's too messy. Now I'm, like, in there. I'm in there. But you know what I mean? Because I was like, oh, they're too messy. I don't want to eat that. And I don't want to, like, you know, they're... Uh, it's too hard to get the meat. I don't want to work for my food. Now I'm like, I'm working. I'm... <laughs> I'm working for those wings, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm- I'm working. I'm gonna work hard. <laughs> Cause I just- I never gave it a chance when I was younger. I never gave it a chance. And then the moment I tried it... Boned? The moment I, I said, I want it boned. <laughs> I said, I want that bone in! That bone- oh my god, they're so good. But they are, they're like a million dollars! Because, like, Rev likes a lot of wings. I'll eat, I mean, I can eat some wings, okay? I can put down some food. But, I'll usually eat about maybe, like, four or five wings, usually, in, like, a piece of pizza. I could probably eat more, honestly. <laughs> I don't. But, like, Rev wants, like, a lot of wings. And so, you have to buy a lot of wings, and wings are not cheap. Like, what the heck? Why are they so expensive? It's a bird. I guess birds only have two legs. Or do they have four? They have four legs. The birds have... Wait. Do chickens have... Do they walk on... <laughs> Chat! Listen. to our society. <laughs> oh, I was never going to be an ag teacher. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I was thinking about their I was thinking about their wings because their wings are like arms and so I wasn't thinking about four feet but I'm like, you know, because if you think if you think about it, a cow technically has two arms and two legs, right? But they just, like, walk on their arms and legs, right? Or does a cow not have any arms? <laughs> I'm asking serious questions here, guys. Because, okay, if you watch, like, if you watch a cartoon... <laughs> if you watch a cow to... <laughs> Barnyard right now in my head, just so you know, it's the visual I'm giving. I'm thinking about barnyard, um, but like I'm imagining barnyard, and whenever he's on, when he's like standing on his hind legs, he's when he's talking, because you know you talk with your hands sometimes. You can talk with your hands. Um, he's talking with the front feet, which are basically like his hands. So. In a way, it's like the cow has two hands, two feet, but he is on the feet and the hands at the same time. <laughs> right? Right? <laughs> you know what I'm- Okay, hold on. Hold on. This image, not this image. It's too good. Okay. Uh, I have to show you what I'm talking about because clearly you're not understanding. And that's okay. I will explain it. See, this is the, the teacher in me coming out. 
Why is he so small? Let's make him large. This is the this is the beautiful man I was thinking of. This movie made me so emotional as a kid. I cried. I would like ball. You guys have seen Barnyard, right? You guys have seen Barnyard, right? Yeah, this is our man Otis. Look, that is his. Tell me that is not his arm. Look, he he literally has hands. Those are his arms. So technically, a cow would have two arms and two legs, but they walk on their arms and legs. <laughs> You're telling me he's not a cow? Then what is he? You're telling me he's not a cow? He literally is a cow. I understand, but it's funnier to believe the four-legged chicken. <laughs> well, I was thinking... Okay, well, I was thinking similarly... I should have I should have said chickens have two arms and two feet. Because if you look at Hold on. <laughs> Fuck. Hold on. Hold, hold on, I'm presenting the facts. Give me a second. I have to present the facts. This is Peck, also from Barnyard. He's transparent. Look, it's like he's flying in there. Anyways, um, can he actually fly? Is he too heavy to fly? Okay, so this we have Peck here. He kind of has two arms and two legs, right? I would say they both. No, he's real. <laughs> They're real. Next, you're gonna tell me Santa Claus doesn't exist. <laughs> look at them. <laughs> and they look so happy together. He looks so he could like fly. I like him like the it, he oh my god because he's transparent he like blends in. It looks like he belongs there. <laughs> they look so good together. <laughs> oh my god. <clears throat> oh my god. It's bro has thumbs. They look nice. They look cute. <laughs> Oh my, it looks like he's giving the chicken a kick in the bum. He's like, ow, that hurt. Fly away. I'll fly away. But you guys know the scene I'm talking about though in Barnyard that's like really emotional. The song, I won't back down. I don't- I won't play it because I don't want to get DMCA'd. It's the Tom Petty song. Well, I won't back down. No, I won't back down. You could stand me up at the gates of hell, but I won't back down. No, I'll stand my ground. Won't be turned around And I'll keep this world from dragging me down Gonna stand my ground And I won't back down Hey, baby There ain't no easy way out Hey, I Will stand my ground and I won't back down. That I did that so I wouldn't get DMCA'd. So you got to hear my lovely, my lovely vocals. <laughs> oh. Sorry, I'm not sure if it works in the UK, the gift card. Oh, cool muffin. Oh no, I never even thought about that. Because it was a US, technically a US competition. Oh, I'm sorry, cool muffin. I never thought about that. Wait, let me look at it. Did you try it and it didn't work? Shab is getting southern on that one. It was very cute. Well, that song, I used to listen to it a lot. Um, I used to listen to it a lot when I was a kid. You can stand me up at the gates of hell, but I won't back down. I don't know. Oh, it says, oh, I'm so sorry. It says in the DoorDash app in the US, I should have read the terms and conditions. I'm sorry. I wasn't even thinking about it. 
trade in the gift card for merch? What do you mean, Risto? What do you mean? Yo, I joined and why is there the cow from the back of the barnyard? We were discussing this amazing movie. <laughs> Here's Peck. We were discussing this amazing movie and how he has technically, in my opinion, two arms and two legs. And so therefore do cows have two arms and two legs and they just walk on their arms and legs? Or is it four legs? But that doesn't make sense. Oh, I'm sorry, Gold Muffin. I... I mean, there's really nothing I can do for that. Um, maybe you can keep the gift card and send him merch instead. This is true. I can keep... Actually, I can keep the gift card for myself, and I can just send you... If you can send me Diva PayPal, I can just send you the $40. And I can just keep the gift card for myself, and you can buy if you want to buy... DoorDash, if you want to go to the, you know, well, don't, don't go right now, because <laughs> you're drunk. <laughs> Unless you get an Uber. Um, or you can spend the merch or whatever you want. Okay? <clears throat> oh, well, straw bluffs or DoorDash? Honestly, a $40 DoorDash gift card wouldn't be so bad. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be a wouldn't be upset. <laughs> do, 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 do. Do, ba, do. Yeah, go muffin. Don't worry about it right now. Do not worry about it right now. I'm sorry for messaging you right now. <laughs> it's okay. I know you're I know you're not um I know you're chilling right now, so don't worry about it. I will I will bring our friends away for now. <laughs> mm. Amazing. But, um, uh, you guys, I can't believe it's a new year. New year. 2024 just does not even sound real. Like, I'm honestly kind of shook. It does not sound real at all. You and Rev doing good this new year so far? Yeah, it's honestly been really great. Um... I'm having a, a nice, a nice old time. Today was like a pretty chill day for me. I honestly didn't do a whole lot of work. I did a lot of cleaning around the house and I uh, took a nice bath and relaxed and uh, basically did my schedule. I sent out all the tier three merch uh, stuff. I made the, whatchamacallit, the Google form for the tier three merch. I sent everyone their DMs, updated the spreadsheets and everything, and ordered all of the the prints today. And that was all the work I really did. I didn't do a whole lot. I didn't do any audio stuff today. I'm waiting till tomorrow. Um, and then I just kind of chilled until stream. Whoa. <laughs> yep. Yes, it is a Straub Twitch Takeover 2024. Let's go. Let's go, baby! We're taking over! We're taking over! Oh yeah, do you guys have resolutions? Do you guys have resolutions? Miraz, thank you so much for the resub for 11 months! Thank you! Thank you so much! Thank you, thank you, thank you! I really appreciate it! Thank you! Oh, forget me when you get famous! I could never! I could never, you guys. Also, oh my god, that- why is my- That is not- I thought I edited this. I thought I edited this. I didn't edit this, guys. I'm going crazy. New merch. It's not really exactly new anymore, but it's kind of new. It's new if you don't know about it. <laughs> why would you let me pin it? I look stupid! There we go. I pinned it. New merch. Ayo. Ayo. Dip a do 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 da ba ba da ba da ba ba. <clears throat> Your New Year's resolutions are to get to 2K gifted by the year's end. <laughs> oh my god, really? Is that your resolution? 2K gifted to me? Or, um. 
2k gifted to me and Rev combined or 2k gifted all around? What do you mean? <laughs> Does not being arrested count? It is generally considered a good thing to not be arrested. So that makes sense to me, actually. Actually, to me, that adds up. I think my New Year's resolution is to be more sociable with other people. Oh, that's a nice one. Stop drinking as much as I did without saying, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, that makes sense, Peach. I, I've been a sober sister for a while now. I, like, never drink anymore. I did not have a drop of... Isekai! Oh my god, we hit our sub points goal! Thank you so much, Isekai, for the 10 gifted. What the heck? Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. What I was saying is I didn't have a drop of alcohol at my wedding. The whole weekend, I didn't have any alcohol. <clears throat> and I haven't had any alcohol. I really can't remember the last time I had a drink, honestly. It was definitely last year at some point, but I don't remember when it was. Um, and it was very few and, uh, like, very few. Maybe, like, maybe, like, once or twice. Maybe three times I had a drink last year. But, um, I mean, think about if you guys knew me back in the day. Uh, it's a little different than I used to be drinking all the time. Um, so yeah, it's nice. It feels good. I like to be in control of myself. And to each their own. Also, not everyone has a drinking problem. For me, it was a problem. Um, and I also have come to realize that I am not someone who likes to drink. Just to drink. To be social. I don't enjoy that, honestly. Um, I... The truth is, I hate the way alcohol tastes. I don't like the way alcohol tastes. I think it tastes gross to me. Um, I don't like a strong drink. I don't really like any drink, but um, I would just drink to get drunk. And the truth is, I would rather have a Diet Coke. I would rather have a sweet tea, um, taste-wise. And really, if I'm not going to get, like, crazy out of my mind drunk i feel like there's no point in drinking and i don't want to get that way so therefore i do not drink anymore is basically what i have come to realize for myself <laughs> um yeah yes 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 but thank you so much isekai oh my gosh you're currently at 1420 gifted subs that's insane 2k for me well, you're very sweet. <laughs> that's very, very sweet of you. You definitely don't need to do that, but if that's what you want to do, that's very sweet of you. Uh, 2024, I aim to be more fruitful in my free time. That's a good goal. I just don't drink, period, partly for religious reasons, partly because I don't see the point. Yeah, I mean, everyone's different. And, like, some people can handle their alcohol. Some people enjoy just socially drinking they can just have a glass of wine two glasses whatever they like to have a drink every now and then that's and that's fine it's you know it's totally your pro and if you want to get drunk i'm not judging you i just think for me it was not something that was healthy and it it really also messed with my mental health and i really feel like and i don't know 100 percent the the like statistics on this stuff but i feel like drinking and like binge drinking specifically really led to me having um worse anxiety slash i don't know if it kind of brought my anxiety out i've heard people say that, that can that can do that um but i feel like i wasn't an anxious person before i started binge drinking in college i i struggled with like depression a lot when i was younger but never um Oh. <laughs> you guys can't see the message. I can see the message. Can't take the truth. Kicked me from your Discord because you didn't like what I had to say. Do us all a favor and game end yourself. Well, lucky for you, I get to see your PayPal information. I get to see exactly. <laughs> Ooh. That's really sweet. Thanks for the dollar. Thanks for the dollar, buddy. Free money! Ooh! 
Amazing! Absolutely amazing! Well, you know, it'd be like that sometimes. It's actually deranged. Yeah. Yeah. Um. But that's okay. I'll be reporting you to PayPal. So, good luck with that. <laughs> that's what I have to say about that. Um, PayPal account. When someone tips you on PayPal, um, you get an email. And unless they have a business account, you can see, like, their name, their email that's attached to it. I don't usually go looking for the information because, you know, I respect my viewers' privacy, but for things like this, um, I will report you to PayPal because you can't just go around telling people to game in themselves. That's not nice. Um, maybe next time try being a nice person and not being um, the way you are. I don't know. It's kind of and my good, yes, I will ignore it. I know people just want attention anyways, so <clears throat> it's probably best to not give it to them, but kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, it's fine. I was not expecting that. But anyways, I don't know, um... Sorry, I was looking at something. But yeah. <clears throat> hey, look at that. I'm actually on time for a stream. Oh, hi. Welcome in, August. Nice to have you here. Hello. Hello, hello. Ugh. Thank you guys for the, um, the beret and the posture check. I need to do my posture check for real. I need to be postured for real, guys. Let's talk about cow arms again. The truth is, stream is probably coming to a close because I was only gonna stream for around an hour tonight because I haven't ate dinner yet. It's 8.34 and I'm hungry. And I don't know what I'm gonna eat. We don't really have any groceries. Um, We're supposed to get groceries tomorrow. So I think we're gonna probably get takeout from somewhere, but I don't know where. Get some Zaxby's. <sighs> don't tempt me with a good time. Don't tempt me with a good time. Salmon for dinner, yummy. Could use that DoorDash. That is true, we could do that. Cracker Barrel, I actually have a Cracker Barrel gift card. I actually have one. From you, right? It was from you. <laughs> took me a second. It took me a second. I got hungry before my base lesson, Oh. <laughs> Well, I hope you I hope you ate something yummy. It was yes. 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 I have it on my um on my phone For the next time I go there, but usually I like to go there for breakfast like a brunch situation But we'll see We'll see technically you can also use the gift card for their gift shop and I do love a good Cracker Barrel gift shop pretty nice <laughs> I should probably head out to have a good night. Oh, have a good night, Baron. Thank you for stopping by. I hope you have a happy new year. I hope everyone has had a happy new year. And yeah, we're going to raid someone. Let's see who we're going to raid. Let's see who we're going to raid. <clears throat> so many people are live. A little overwhelming. All my links are being spammed in the chat if you'd like to check me out um, on my other platforms. If you want to buy some Straub merch, I have my Uwe Market shop. I also have the fourth wall store with some embroidered merch. And, and I will be having a new merch drop. Uh, whenever I have my new outfit reveal and if you guys didn't see I'm actually doing an art contest on Twitter Which let me plug that really quick if you guys didn't see that already. It's my pin tweet on Twitter If you're an artist or if you know an artist that might be interested the $750 prize pool 
Um, first place is getting 400, I believe. Second place, I believe, is 200, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, and then third place is 150. Um, and then five other people will get a tier one gifted sub to the channel. And yeah, it's gonna be really fun. I'm excited. We're gonna showcase all of the, uh, all of the entries on stream like we did a couple years ago during my last one. And I'm really excited for it. I'm super excited to see all the art that we get. It's gonna be lots of fun. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, let's see. We are going to raid Nicole. Rip Nicole is live. One of my good friends. She's doing art. It's her first stream of 2024 as well. So let's go send her a nice raid. Everyone be very friendly and sweet. And yeah, we're going to raid my friend Nicole. I love them. That's when I became a regular when you first did it. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh no, the raid command. Oh no! Oh, you can fix it really quick. It's just Strawby Raid now. Strawby Raid. <clears throat> Strawby Raid, Strawby Raid. I could fix it really quick if I had my laptop open. No, you guys! You guys! Ah, no! I'm, I'm slow, I'm slow. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm so slow. Oh, there it is. Risto fixed it. Risto fixed it. Risto fixed it. There we go. Risto fixed it. Copy paste, copy paste, copy paste. Thank you, Risto. <laughs> Risto's always saving the day. Okay. Mm, hope you guys have a good night. I'll see you later. Bye.